we just got some major news regarding the pokemon diamond and pearl remakes that might shock you if you guys saw my last video i talked about the possibility of a let's go diamond and let's go pearl well guys let's go Sinnoh has been officially confirmed by the pokemon company in a teaser tweet by pokemon company they tweeted let's go Sinnoh turtwig chimchar and piplup are preparing for pokemon day it's only four days away so that's the confirmation that we needed pokemon tweeted let's go Sinnoh which practically confirms the next let's go game will be a Sinnoh region remake as much as people were looking forward to the traditional Pokemon game for the Diamond and Pearl remakes, it's looking like it'll be in the form of a Let's Go game. The likelihood for the naming convention would be something along the lines of Let's Go Sinnoh Diamond and Let's Go Sinnoh Pearl. I honestly don't see how Pokemon Company could release the Diamond and Pearl remakes without including Diamond and Pearl in the actual name. Now, one thing that's currently leading many fans to believe that it might not actually be a Let's Go game is the fact that Pokemon Company didn't actually capitalize the G like it is for Let's Go Pikachu and let's go eevee so this could be that pokemon company is just doing the classic misdirection that leads fans to believe that it will be a let's go game but in all actuality it could turn out to be a traditional pokemon game utilizing the same engine as sword and shield one thing i will say is you have to understand that this is just classic marketing they knew exactly what they were doing whenever they put the words let's go in that tweet they wanted to create the conversation and get people talking about the possibility of the diamond and pearl remakes being a let's go game now as much as i wasn't really a fan of the let's go games i am excited to see what they do for let's go sino if it is indeed that i really hope this remake is not a copy and paste of the let's go format i hope they build upon the let's go format and give us back the features that makes it into more of a traditional pokemon game for instance i don't want to have to use a joy con for the pokemon let's go games i would rather use my pro controller to play pokemon so hopefully the ball throwing mechanic is improved and they give people the ability to play on the nintendo switch Lite or the pro controller without having to use the motion control aspect and of course we can't forget to mention the wild encounters that's one thing that was missing with pokemon let's go pikachu and eevee so hopefully they add it back for the Sinnoh remakes so as long as the pokemon company improves on everything that they did wrong with pokemon let's go pikachu and eevee then i will be perfectly fine with let's go Sinnoh. obviously there's going to be a lot of people that are upset about this decision but what i'll tell you right now is just give it some time let's see some gameplay first and then judge it so many people are quick to jump on the hate train for pokemon as of lately so i would just give it some time let's see what the games look like before we instantly judge but as i just stated before it is a possibility that this let's go Sinnoh teaser by pokemon company is just a misdirection there's four days away until the pokemon day and we are on the verge for the next pokemon direct which i'm hoping will be announced tomorrow with the direct being on thursday now i previously stated that i think that we're going to be getting two games announced at the next pokemon direct and if the Sinnoh region remake is going to be a let's go game then that means let's go johto is pretty much dead on arrival that is a piece of speculation that we can go ahead and bury if that's the case but i still have just a little bit of hope for let's go johto to be completely honest this could be pokemon company teasing the let's go Sinnoh remakes to kind of manage people's expectations one thing that pokemon fans and rather gaming fans like to do is take a little bit of information and speculate it to the end of the earth and get their expectations so high that it's just impossible to manage one thing is for certain is we will be definitely getting the pokemon diamond and pearl remakes in some sort of capacity i really wasn't expecting it to be a let's go game but i guess my video from yesterday kind of cursed me because i said i was going to throw that idea in the trash and then what do you know they decide to tweet out let's go sino either way guys it is an exciting time time to be a pokemon fan i can't wait to see what they do for the next pokemon direct and see what other announcements they have in store for pokemon week are you excited about pokemon let's go Sinnoh, or would you rather have a traditional pokemon game for the remakes let me know in the comment section hit the like button subscribe to my channel and don't forget to stay tuned for new updates in regards to pokemon as well as nintendo thank you guys all once again for watching this has been wes and i will talk to you on the next video